hopefully it'll start to get a little cooler once the air conditioning kicks in. Uh, so here in Durham, as an academic community, we like to give people, visitors, uh, intelligence tests uh, to, to prove that they belong here. <clears throat> so the fact that you were able to drive here, park, and find this place on the fourth floor uh, shows how intelligent all of you are. So thank you. <laughs> the ten or so people haven't arrived yet, we can we can relay that to them later. <laughs> so a uh, couple things: uh, bathrooms in the hall, men's and women's. Uh, please don't go that way. Please go this way. Uh, there is Wi-Fi available. We are live streaming off that connection. So if you have a you know a 3G connection, use that. Save us a little bandwidth. Uh, but if uh, you do need Wi-Fi, there's passwords up here. So the Idea Greenhouse, it is a space for creative people and entrepreneurial people in the university, in the community to come together and make great ideas grow. We rent cubes and desks, we have space for people to work, we have a conference room, all that kind of stuff. But really what we are is a community. And I'm proud to see a number of our members and tenants here today. Uh, they probably couldn't get any work done anyway, so they thought they'd join the, join the show. Um, so afterward, you'll have a chance. If it says member on their on their name tag, please chat them up about what we do here. Um, we are live streaming live on Ustream. Uh, we sold out by a lot, as you can tell. So hopefully, there's some people there watching. Um, so if you want to tweet that or otherwise tell your community to to watch this live, it'll also be recorded so people can watch it later. And um, thanks to Mike Muldoon of Mike's Mac and More, who is uh, way more technical than I am. All his equipment, he knows what he's doing. He'd be happy to live stream your event for a large fee, I'm sure. Um, I also need to thank the Durham Marketplace, uh, which sponsored the after party. We have sushi, not bad. Sushi and beer and, and a bunch of goodies, so please stick around after. I will encourage some of you to help push some chairs out of the way so we have some places to stand. Obviously, it's a full house. Um, so please stick around after the event to, to socialize a little bit. Uh, I also need to thank uh, the prime sponsor and really the originator of this event, which is our friends from Cook Little, Matt Benson, Jason, any of your other colleagues here I haven't met? Okay. A terrific law firm based in Manchester that also has a presence here at Idea Greenhouse, working exclusively with entrepreneurs. It's all they do is business law for entrepreneurs. Um, you want to take a minute and just say hi and let the world know about Cook Little? Hi. <laughs> Uh, I think, Tom, I think you did a great job. I mean, our tagline is business lawyer for entrepreneurs, um, and really is a, a, a business-based firm, and really what we do is work with companies all the way from the stage of startup all the way to the point where uh, there's some kind of exit, everything in between. So if you have any business-related questions, we're here periodically for office hours. I'm happy to sit down and always talk about business issues that are on your mind. Something we like to do anyway. So, yeah, so coming thanks back. Thanks for coming. Oh, sorry, coming back in the fall, uh, I think starting in September, uh, they're going to do a little legal series, so we're going to do some uh, free legal training stuff, and they'll have office hours, which are just open to all. You have to register ahead of time. And if you get on our email list, you'll know all about those. Quick thanks to Sandra Rand of OpenNet Media, terrific social media consultant, good friend of the Greenhouse, and a member who has been super helpful today. Uh, my wife, Jennifer, who also is... This, you would not believe what this place would look like without her. So. <laughs> we probably have white walls, let's put it that way. Um, and last but not least, Ben Grabo over here, who was an intern for me this spring at the New Hampshire Innovation Commercialization Center, just graduated from UNH. He's one of those incredibly talented, smart college graduates that hasn't yet gotten the job he wants. So if anybody's hiring in communications, marketing, uh, or just hardworking guy, see Ben. He's got about three weeks of housing left before he has to go back to New Jersey and live with his parents. <laughs> we don't want to lose him. He's that good. Okay. Uh, any questions before we get started? Do we need anything? Any accommodations? We have some water up here. It's a little awkward. Oops, somebody's late. Uh, a little awkward to get to it, but maybe you could raise your hand and Ben would circulate it if, if you get hot and want some water. So the schedule. We're going to start off with Tom Young. And then I uh, have Mike Norman, uh, who was not able to come in person, but we're going to have to Skype in uh, from WeFunder, Matt Benson. Uh, I'm going to do some uh, case studies really quickly, and then we're going to have the panel discussion. You've all seen the schedule, and we're going to try our best to wrap up by five. Any questions? Okay. So. Uh